This was her victory, nice and fresh. You can see her just camping in behind the speed. It was a slowly, slowly run race. Uh, she showed a lovely turn of foot. Now do note that this race has produced five subsequent winners thereafter. And I just like the acceleration she showed to really put her rivals away. So this is over the sprint trip. Uh, she subsequently had a run over the 1400 meters, but she went from a slowly run 1200 to a fast run 1400 meters. And I think that just found her out a touch. And it was a pretty deep 1400 meters. I don't think the same can be said for this race. With due respect there on Wednesday, I think she has them covered and a repeat of this performance. And I think she'll be winning it and winning it pretty well. She should get the right run just in behind the speed. You can see her splits there, 11.23 and 11.58. So really nice strength through the line. That's Strand Beauty coming down the outside and he has gone on with it since. So I think she finds the right race at the right time to bounce back. Uh, Karen McAvoy sticks, 34.54 was her last 600 metres, uh, which was the quickest in the race. No great surprise given how dominant she was on the line and 11.58. So I like the way that she really quickened that last little bit, 11.58, that last bit. So you can see Diddle Dumpling didn't track there. She has subsequently won, Strand Beauty's won, Pantoja's won in Melbourne, Snitsanova has won at the midweeks and even Full Metal Jacket, who ran 10th, came out and won at odds at its subsequent start. So I want to be really forgiving of that last start performance, Nick, that did look a pretty deep race. I think the winner of the 300 is going towards the spring stakes on Saturday at the Hunter meeting. But if I captain runs to that level again, uh, I do think she'll justify being centre out as favourite. Yeah, it'd be very hard to beat if he runs to that level. I, I really like your point with the five subsequent winners. Uh, that always draws me in, especially if you put 1,400 back to the 12 and they're coming out of that high pressure race, as you said, that doesn't concern me at all. I think that's almost a plus. So, yeah, I, I think it's a, a bet, an easy one to have as well.